Okay, guys, welcome. This should be a Wednesday show, by the way. It's going to be basically this is a quick unmailing, and the bottom one is my second month of Boxed Heroes. So we'll go over that one last, I think. So, either way, let's get to the quick unboxing part first. And then we will do the Boxed Hero box for the next, or last, I mean, sorry. Let's go with. Um, as far as I know, two of these should be eBay. I'm not sure what the other one is. Could be, I don't know, could be anything. For now on, like I said, guys, we're going Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I'm slowing down on buying boxes. I've spent too much. And wife, we're talking about selling the house and moving. I'm not very far away. Just nearby, but, you know, close enough to where... Oh, okay. It's kind of weird. I'm not sure what this is. Uh... It must be just one book then. Yep, okay, X-Force number 10, cheap book. Beginning the Mystery of the Externals. As we all know, the Externals movie is coming out. This one's in a little better shape. I understand this is still one of their first of the, of the ones that might be in the movie version. So, yeah, just a quick little eBay extra buy. Wanted a few of them to hang on to. So, there you go, X-Force number 10. And some junk I'm going to throw away. So it's gonna be a pretty quick video. I'm gonna try to look at the actual. Well, now I don't have it with me. I was gonna look up how much the stuff I get from Box Heroes is worth, but it may not matter this time. Which I'll show you in a minute. Ah, if you guys weren't around for my last, my first ever real Box Hero, my first one before I did the subscription, I actually got one of the G, one of the grand, one of the prizes. It was a signed New Mutants number one, signed by like two or three people, nine point four, I think. So. The second one, I the books were okay, but when you took the books out of their nice mylar, wouldn't the mylar is nice? The books were damaged. I mean, they just really were. I can't handle damaged books. So I mean, I don't mind if they're in decent shape, but some of them. I mean, there was like nothing even CGC, you know, worthy in it. This is a kind of neat way. Give up on the entire thing of doing a uh, tape and just do it in a tape plastic wrap. Let's see what we got. Ah, yes. Ravencroft number one, spec book. Picked it up along with this just came with it. <laughs> it's me it did at least. Venom twenty one. It's Donny Gates one? It's a variant. I don't think I had this one. Interesting. I gotta go look at that. So very happy on those two. The Ravencroft, with everybody talking about it being a TV show on with sorry. Um with the Strange Academy being the T V show. On Disney Plus, Ravencroft number one has a bunch of the characters that could be in it. This is their first appearance as one. This is the alternative variant or alt edition. There's some third printings and first printings still coming, but very happy on those. And this, I, uh, yeah. Uh, how'd they tape it? What's the easiest way to get through this sucker? I feel like I do it. Tape on both sides of the box. Take the tape off first. <coughs> and. And just rip and tear at it. Let's see what it is. I think this is. Oh, I don't know. Another. Here we go. Oh. Okay. Sorry, guys. I'm trying my best to get it, but. Everyone says, we hate the way you look you, when you take down the books. I posted a video. I don't know how long this will probably be posted on Wednesday. I think I'm going to go early on this video and move them around. I posted a video with my face yesterday. Oh no! The dreaded packing peanuts. Came, oh, they didn't even wrap the damn thing. They just threw the packing peanuts around it. Hope it's not damaged. I have learned now to, yes. I used to do packing peanuts. Never again. And what we have is... I'm not sure what that is. Uh, a price tag on the back. I don't agree with it, but hey, it's up to them. What we have is... Wow, okay, a PGX. This is my first PGX book. It is... Uh, I don't have any PGX books. They want $129 for this thing normally. I yeah, paid $70. X-Men number 29, a find very fine missing staple. Oh, well, came in production, I guess. It's, so it's an error. Ooh. Uh, Werner, uh, Werner Roth Art 
Roy Thomas story, Mimic Leaves the X-Men, graded 1 of 15, 115, so graded a long time ago. I don't think this thing can get a 7. It is dark as anything. So, either way, it is really dark. My first PGX book, now I see why they get a bad rap. This thing's probably like a 5. Oof, it's definitely not a 7. Okay, last up, Box Heroes. <coughs> now here's where things get interesting. Like I said, I'm not going to look up price and stuff cost. Box Heroes normally sends their stuff out. It could be. It's pretty heavy. It normally sends out their stuff inside of a box. I mean, a box and then and then it covered in a bag. Now, when I got the slab in the mail, it came like this. So there's no way two out of three Box Hero boxes I got a slab or a grand or one of their yearly weekly giveaways. If I did, I'll post this one early. Last week, I mean, last time I had a problem with the Box Heroes is because they were, the comic books were just, they were not bad, but they were just damaged. When you took them out of the thing, they were, it looked like, you know, humidity damage and just, I don't know. It's like the Mylar was hiding anything that looked bad on it. I took all the books out and just had a better look at it. So give me a moment, I will have this out. Trying not to make too much of a mess with it. Especially, this is a good knife I got. Better than the last one. So this could be just the ten books, which it could be. I'm good with that. Or there's a chance we got another prize. It's easy to tell pretty quick because once you go like this, <coughs> you see. And as you guys can see, this is not the normal slab boxes. So this is not their normal box. The normal box is about the same size as a one from Street Level Heroes, or that's that's Spider-Man booth. This is a slab box, so I I'll, I'll I will gladly stick with them for a while, I guess. So what slab did we get? Their website had a bunch of different ones. I looked. I'm gonna let you guys see first. I'm looking away in the opposite direction, so I don't see. Is it? Is it good? It's, oh, it's upside down. I'm not sure what this is. I have no idea what we just got in their normal stuff, guys. Slide. And I will post this. I don't. Subscriber bonus. Oh, they actually give you the subscriber bonus book, even if you get their slabs. So, this is interesting. Let's go. Well, we're just going to see what we got. Oh, <laughs> it's actually. Ooh, it's a signature series book. I can see that. I'm happy with that. Very nice. So, I haven't hit, this is the only company I've hit a GP with. Ever. That Spider-Man booth, I will never get the GP with. <laughs> so we get, you get your extra bonus book, even if you... Uh, there's no way around this. We're just going to have to do it. Let's see if we can open it. We'll try not look at the grade or whatever it is. Let's get the uh, extra book out first. I can... Put this over here. Oh, I just saw what it was. Oh, well. Ooh, the extra bonus book. I don't have this cover yet. Death Metal 3. Hole. Oh, I don't think I have this cover yet. If I do. Wow. Art Germ Cover. Guys. Holy mackerel. I like that one. That might go right to CGC. That is beautiful. I like the Death Metal stuff. I don't know why. I'm on a wall full of CGC books. So I am, whoa. Okay, now let's get back to uh, another one. <laughs> this is my second one. Is this 800? No. This is Symbiote Spider-Man number one. Sweet, guys. Signed by Scotty Young, Greg Land, Jay Leastman, and Peter David. My God, everybody. Peter David's story, Greg Land, is signed by the whole group. Holy crap. Can I use a big word? Holy shit. 9.8. Okay, guys. Box Heroes has got me for a while. Wow. That is incredible, guys. I did not expect that from them, but I, I don't know how good of a hit this is. We'll have to take a look. It's probably a 1 of 75 or a 1 of 50. I wouldn't care. It's still a beautiful slab. It's a Scotty Young variant. So, Spazer... Yeah, it's Symbiote Spider-Man number one. I'm very happy. I don't know. I might keep it. I might not. Who knows? But it is triple signed. Wait, one, two, four. 
four-way signed. Hody Mackerel. Okay, guys, that's it for today. I'll post this one today. Well, I'll post it for Wednesday. Thanks for watching.